We continue our fall sports preview and now move to the sport of volleyball. One thing is for sure, Nebraska Kearney will not repeat as conference champion as the Lopers have shifted to the MIAA. It seems the balance of power in Armac volleyball has gone from the cornfields of Nebraska to the Mile High City. According to the preseason coaches poll, the top three teams in Armac volleyball are all within a 15 mile radius of each other. In the top spot is Metro State. The Roadrunners have been to the NCAA tournament for 11 years in a row, but this is the first time they've been picked to win the league since 2003. When we talked to the team today about who cares what we are on a piece of paper, you know, that's an opinion poll, and we haven't played a single point of volleyball. So right now we're just trying to find ourselves. Um, our leadership has definitely come to the surface through the spring uh, and is, sh is showing very well right now. The runners are led by preseason all-conference players Lauren Quijano and Alyssa Heath. Number two is Colorado Mines. The ore diggers have been to the NCAAs for the past three years in a row. Preseason Player of the Year Jackie Stabell returns, as does Preseason Defensive Player of the Year Hannah Margheim. In the third spot is Regis. The Rangers are led by head coach Frank LaVricia. Now in his 26th season as head coach, he returns nine letter winners from 2011. Adam State is predicted to win the West Division and are fourth overall. The Grizz have Preseason Setter of the Year Gabriella Riffolato and Preseason All-Armac Selection Dominique Davis. Next is Western New Mexico, led by preseason all-conference pick Angelina Pulu. Colorado Christian is sixth, then it's UCCS who returns senior Nikki Kinzer. Eighth is Colorado Mesa, then it's CSU Pueblo, Fort Lewis, Western State, New Mexico Highlands, Shadron State, and Black Hill State. 